I have been scared to solve the Zetamix ever since it broke on me when I tried to solve it. No, 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 no. It took me four hours to fix, and I was scared to touch the puzzle ever since. But until I found out, I have not seen a video of someone solving the Zenimix physically on YouTube. Probably because people don't torture themselves for fun. So let's be the first! Also, since I am locked in my room all day playing with Rubik's Cubes, I want to touch grass. So I'm going to be bringing this puzzle at various public locations so I can experience the world. So let's go to our first location, Bobo Shaw. Hopefully, the puzzle does not break on us while we're in public because that would be embarrassing. What we're doing, we're building the centers in the middle first for every side. It's been an hour and 20 minutes and this is all I have done. And there's 12 more of these I have to do. So we got a long way to go. With the years I have been cubing, I have always wondered, what if I was not always trapped inside cubing? Basically what I'm doing now, I'm trying to get these little bars here to create this, right? But you see what's very tricky about this is that I'm trying to find this single piece here. If you look, there's so many white pieces and there's one of them that fits correctly. So it's like needle in the haystack right now. Nice. There we go. Now we just need this last piece that goes here. So I just found it and then lost it. Stress. It shouldn't be that hard. I found it. It's this piece right here. We have a line here and then now we're gonna move this in like that. So we just need to build around this now and we're finished. I saw a random customer at the boba shop and wanted to ask, so how long do you think it'd take me to solve this cube? This is all I have done and it's been one hour and 52 minutes and this is all I have done. I think two hours and 45 minutes. You're too generous. Thank you. You're too generous. So we're almost done with the white center. We just got to get these outside bars. Once you get more pieces done, the easier it is to solve. It's been two hours and we only finish almost one center. Bro, where's this piece? This is so hard. Actually, never mind. I'm not feeling good about this. Uh, it gets cow on pieces, so you gotta be very careful. There we go. You're like sitting here with a plastic object, trying to find that single piece that fits somewhere, and you just can't find it. it, it this kind of reminds me of life. People are trying to find themselves. They're trying to find that one pretty piece, that, which is like your passion. I don't know. Right, the single last piece needs to fit here. Let's try to find it. I don't know if this is the best way to solve it, so please don't roast me in the comments. I, I just want to solve this, get this over with. Here we go. One center is done after two hours and 13 minutes. 11 more to go. This is so tiring. Could take a quick break. Taking a break. Got some rice. What do you like about it? Rice is so simple. That's what I like about it. It fills you up. Unlike soup. I hate soup. I hate soup. Rice is better. Don't put that in. Don't put, put that, that in. That in. Put that in. No, don't put, put, put in, that put in. in. I hate soup. All right, we're going to move on to the next center. My favorite color is green. It's a white sun, not green. been two hours and 36 minutes. So I realized when solving this, my eyes get so tired. There's so many pieces on here. It's been tough. It's been two hours and 49 minutes. This is all we have in 40 minutes, bro. <sighs> Finish the green second part. With the amount of colors in your face, fatigue quickly sets in. I was starting to fall asleep and zone out that I could not even drink water properly. So it's been three hours and 40 minutes. This is all we did. This green here. I t it took me forever to find this piece here. Now we have two more lines to go to. This is not fun. To make it worse, the cube was not turning well. So I had to apply lubrication. I have lube, so the lube should hopefully reduces the friction like that. This is sad about the progress we have so far. Almost on hour four. How long do you think it'll take me to solve this? Two sides, four hours, two, four. I think it'll take you another four. Four hours? Maybe another three and a half. Man, people are so generous. So in total, how many hours? 12? Yeah, I was thinking 12, but maybe less. Okay, that's accurate, 12 hours. Been on this green forever, man. I just can't think no more. It's been four hours and 43 minutes. It's been a while. How does it take this long? There's no way. There are so many pieces on this puzzle that my mind is hurting from trying to find the correct piece. I just want to do something else, man. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm looking for anymore. Oh. This is literally finding a needle in a haystack. 
when starting this puzzle. But with this moment of vulnerability is an opportunity for growth, a chance to prove our resilience over our fears. For me, that's solving this puzzle and trying to go out more and socialize more with people. All right, last five pieces for green, and then we officially finished two centers for this green piece here. We can move that down here, slap the cube a little. I'm so excited right now, I'm about to finish this. Should go right here. Imagine it pops right now. Dude, I would legit cry. As I went on to finishing the green center, my insanity was kicking in. If you have anger issues, buy this cube. Putting in our last green piece right here. We're done with green. Five hours and 30 minutes for two centers. I'm so proud. And now we have 10 more sides. Yay. This is depressing. Like it's raining outside too. To burn off our calories from the boba, the next location we are gonna go to is the gym. We're at the gym now, burning off some calories from the boba. So now we're gonna solve the purple side, the third side. Us sitting at that boba shop for five hours was really torturing. So we need to get some movement. So let's work out and solve this at the same time. So after our set, we're gonna do a little bit of solving to get two things done at the same time. Smart, right? Or is it a bad idea? How long do you think it's gonna to take to solve this? Have you ever solved it? No. Two sides took me five hours and 30 minutes. So there's 12 sides in total. Yeah, like 24 <laughs> hours, something We're like that. We're trying to do one side in the gym. So you're gonna be the first guy in the First USA guy in USA to solve this. Hi, what's your name? Timmy. So we're solving this inner purple. Like last time, the biggest struggle with solving this was finding the pieces. But I think after us experience those first two sides, we should have more experience now with figuring out where pieces go. Back to our gym set. I try to hit every major muscle group in this workout, from chest presses, pull-ups, curls, squats, and whatever exercises that was gonna get me swole. Okay, so now we're finishing the first inner circle like that. Let's increase our weight now. Now we're doing 50s. Go big or go home. Last set. Doing exercises while solving was very physically exhausting. Mentally wise, my head was not hurting as much as in the boba shop. I guess moving really helps ease the mental part of solving. This is like the SAT where I can't find a single piece, but I'm still gonna put it in and then come back to it later. Don't spend too much time on any problem, just move on. Found the piece that I was missing. More progress is coming. I'm so tired already. So it's officially been seven hours now. This is all we got. We didn't finish the purple side, unfortunately, so we gotta stay here longer. There's gonna be a big problem later. Since this puzzle popped before and the edges fell out, we might have to break the cube again to make sure it's solvable still when we get to the edge step. So hopefully we don't have to break the cube open, but like I'm 99% sure we have to break this cube open. It's been seven hours and 30 minutes. We're almost done with purple. I'm getting pretty tired, so I'm taking a break. We. Oh. Okay, we're hitting legs now. I hate legs. I hate leg day. I try not to skip leg day. Dude, it feels like I'm gonna bleed. I don't think I can do this. All right, we're skipping leg day. All right, so now we're almost done. We just need this outer line. All right, let's plank and do this at the same time. Okay, this is harder than I thought. It's hurt so much. Ah! Holding this is heavy too. Let's put a timer how long I can last on this. Mm. It's not turning. No, come on, man. One more line. Ah. Can't do it. Mm. Getting pretty tired, so we're just gonna solve this. Finish this last one here at the gym, and then we'll move on to our next location. The gym was the best option for me to loosen up to get my mind right on solving this puzzle. All right, we're almost done. We got this single little purple piece and then this line to fill in. The hardest part about this cube is finding the pieces and maintaining your sanity. Boom, boom, boom. Gym is such a sacred place. It's where people are the most vulnerable, I, I think. Like, people are here to work on themselves and it's so inspiring to see. All right, last purple piece. Move this here, boom, boom. 
fixed it. Yay. We got three sides now. Oh my goodness. It's been eight hours in total. For three sides, eight hours. I was feeling physically tired now more than mentally. After that long day at the gym, I decided to go home and take a break. But I still wanted to solve a bit. Taking a nice break from the outside and doing two centers at home. I did not realize this, but my table moved a whole feet while I was solving. 10 hours in and we completed two more centers, totaling to five centers completed now. I realized I look like an idiot walking around with this. It's only 9 a.m. It's like 85, almost 90 degrees. I don't go to the beach often at all. Even though I live in Florida, we have like some really nice beaches. Um, but this one, I don't think it's super nice. But hey, it's something. I'm experiencing a new environment because I'd never go to the beach because I hate the heat. I hate the messiness. I hate the sand. You can even tell I'm wearing long sleeves. And that's not normal. I didn't want to wear sunscreen on my arms, but I have some on my face. I'm already burning. I literally haven't been here for 10 minutes yet. Uh, we're gonna be solving the blue side now. It's the sixth side. We're right above the airplane. Found shade. I'm really germaphobic sometimes. Like, I'm not gonna put this here on this disgusting table. So I'm gonna be solving on my lap. So my neck is gonna be in pain, but it's worth it. I don't wanna get this puzzle dirty. 10 hours, 40 minutes so far. Let's see if we can solve the blue side in under 12 hours. That's the goal. So this is the progress so far, that big blue. I feel like I'm getting way faster at this. It hasn't been 11 hours yet, and we're almost done with the blue side. I'm really happy about that. The beach was an uncomfortable position since I did not want to place my cube on the table. Been over 11 hours, and the goal was to finish this blue side before it hits 12 hours. We can do this. Being out here is pretty nice. I said I hated the beach, but actually, I'll consider coming back. Oh shoot, oh look at that. Luckily we can put this back pretty easily. All right, it's been 11 hours and 40 minutes. Just gotta solve this outer blue line. My neck is really hurting now because I've been looking down for like almost an hour now. Yeah, Two more lines. It's not turning. Oh. We got one last line to solve. And it's 11 hours and 55 minutes. We have under five minutes to solve this last blue piece. Let's see if we can do it. Let's go. Sub 12 hours for solving six sides on this would be great. Four minutes, four minutes. Come on, bro. Turn. There we go. Six sides is done. Under 12 hours. I'm gonna go relax. Probably get some boba right now. Solve some more at the boba shop. Six more sides. <laughs> Pink is going to be the first color we work on because it's the easiest color to look for. Everyone around me at this boba shop is super relaxed, sipping their drinks while I am over here banging my head with annoyance. 12 hours, 26 minutes, almost an hour, bro. I'm not even done with pink. Bro, I'm getting sleepy. This is harder than I thought. Honestly, I might prefer to be at the beach instead. But I am trying to keep a very positive mindset throughout this to keep me going. Oh! <gasps> No, 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 it's pop. The piece is pop, bro. Oh, no. It's fixed. That was a close call, really close call. But I pushed through the centers and took mini breaks frequently every 20 minutes. All right, the last pink piece for the center and we're done with pink. There you go. Pink is done. Seven sides is done after 13 hours and 15 minutes. That took forever. Next color we're doing is tan. But I don't understand how there's like not many pieces left. I think I just suck. This cube makes me feel like a beginner again. My body also tensed up too, and my posture begins to suffer. Almost done. The challenge with the puzzle now is not finding the colors now, it's actually turning the cube. It doesn't turn that well. 14 hours now, this whole cube on the seventh side. So the meaning each side takes two hours on average. Resuming the tan, almost done. Uh oh, it's popping. It's popping, man. That's not good. Come on, bro. Another close call. I have a massive wedgie sitting here for like hours now. All right, we have three more pieces left. Last piece. I said I was gonna do three centers, but I have no more mental capacity for that. So I'm gonna call it a day after this last piece. 
we're done with the tan side. After 14 hours and 28 minutes, four seven sides. That was a bug. I hate bugs. Here at the baseball game now, it's really loud. Hopefully I can focus on the ZMX solve or maybe watch the baseball game a bit. Never been to a professional baseball game in my life. My first time, looks really fun. So this is gonna be really interesting to see if we can solve this and still maintain focus. I never been to a professional baseball game before and I was worried I was gonna get the weirdest looks while I was solving this puzzle. And I did. Hour 14, we have four more centers left and we're gonna do sky blue now. Also, if I wasn't looking, I feel like the ball could hit me at any time. We're making progress. My neck is starting to hurt. This is a nice experience. Solving was getting much easier now since we have completed the majority of the centers, meaning we don't have to rotate much to find pieces. We're almost done with this blue side. It's only been like 40 minutes so far. Good progress. We're on the last row for sky blue now and then we're done. This is the ninth center. All right, last line, one more. But I was zoned in and did not let the weird looks and the loud noise distract me from solving. Did at a baseball game, hour 15 to complete it. I wanted to complete the puzzle at the baseball game, but sometimes life doesn't go your way. So yeah, I have to bring the big Zetamix puzzle on the plane now and solve it until I finish it. I just landed to LA in California and then found out that Max Park just broke the 3x3 world record single. So I rushed to it and had to check out how the competition environment was and if Max could possibly break another world record. So we're at the comp now, it's pretty packed. What's crazy is I'm not even supposed to be at this competition. I'm not even signed up to compete. This was my first time bringing a Zenimix to a competition. This is the progress we have. And some people were asking if they could help me solve it. But I declined because I really wanted to make sure I solved 100% of it. Solving the Zetamix while many people were staring at me was first somewhat uncomfortable for the first 10 seconds, but I got over it and focused in on the solve. Ben! Friend Ben, we What's met up? at North American Championships. We're back here. Dude, why are you here? I, I just got off the plane, right? Uh -huh. And I saw the record, so I came down here. That's crazy. Dude, how, guess how long it had been taking me? How many hours? How many hours? 30. 30 hours? It took 15 hours so far. Hours, 15 hours. This is the judge for the Max Parks world record right here. How did it feel seeing the, the world record? Very fast. Very fast. Did yeah. you freak out? I, saw you, I think I saw you freak out. You have to yeah. explain it. You freak did out. freak out. So you can see the video. You look and then it's solved. <laughs> Double X cross, PLL skip. PLL skip? No yeah, way. Got, yeah, you. What was it all the well? He got um, fat soon. That's the oh, oh, we got fat soon. Oh. It was, it was. Can't believe I finally met Max Park, the world record holder. Hi, congratulations on your world record. Woo! Let's go! Yeah, let's go! When I was solving this puzzle at this competition, it drew attention and gathered a crowd. I think because nobody has seen a puzzle this massive in person. It was so cool to see people around supporting us on finishing this center. Almost there. I just want to finish green and I'm, I'm done. Last commentator, last commentator. Nearly 16 hours for 10 sides. We have two more left. After I finished the Lime Green Center, I went and watched the competition and attended the events I was in California for. And then went to the airport and head home for the day. And of course, when I was heading home, my bags got checked by airport security. Luckily, it was fine and went and worked on the orange and gray center before we headed home. Realistically, I only did 4 minutes of solving before I needed to go catch my flight. Now that I am at home, I can recharge my introverted battery. Being outside drains me, even if I'm not talking to people. And of course, right when we're about to finish the centers, a piece got jammed and popped out. At this point, I have learned to stay extremely calm, unlike before, to have a clear mind and solve the issue. I am feeling more comfortable at home and I can't wait till all the centers are solved here. Seeing the pieces starting to look more organized is super satisfying. Turning the outer layers more, pieces started to get caught with each other and I was getting worried about the puzzle popping again. With the puzzle breaking completely the first time, having to put it back together randomly, I thought I would have impossible cases but luckily, I did not have any for the edges. 
Ending this puzzle off made me realize how much we push ourselves out of our comfort zone, from staying indoors constantly to out in the real world, trying to socialize with anyone who came to our path. I was not going to let social anxiety hold me back from trying new and meaningful experiences. This final trip, I'm going to VidCon, an opportunity for me to connect with so many unique people. And you can say, I did that. I was so deep in the present moment with people that I did not even record any of it. And the footage you're seeing is from my friends. This is also the moment of truth. All right, it's hour 19 and 38 minutes, approaching 20 hours, and we are very close of finishing this puzzle after almost 20 hours. Huge satisfaction is coming our way. We just have to solve these two edges, and then we're done. We're gonna finish the puzzle now. After traveling for weeks, I've been putting this puzzle off. I tried to finish it at VidCon, but it was really hard to film. I was just so into like with conversations with people and I just forgot to film at all, anything about this puzzle. But I want to finish this puzzle now so I can be officially over with it after almost 20 hours of my life dedicated to this. Let's finish it off. We are officially finished with all the edges. Woo! Hey, look at that. We're gonna get this nice green here. There we go. Okay, now we're gonna get this pink side. You can see the puzzle starting to come together now. This is probably the most satisfying step right now. It's the easiest too, out of all the steps we have finished. One more side. Looking good. All right, we're less than 30 moves away from being finished. Whew. All right, last step. Oh shoot, oh shoot, the puzzle's popping. Oh no. Okay, we fixed it. Heart attack. Whew. The real fear was never about solving the Zetanix, but overcoming our comfort zone, experiencing as much as we can and taking on new and different environments because they opened doors to new and exciting opportunities. Whether it was a super hot beach or the loud baseball game, I can appreciate the moments the Zetanix has taught me. Yes! 19 hours and 45 minutes completed. First person on YouTube to solve this, and I think in America. Whew, that felt so great. Yeah. It taught me to never let your past fears shape your today. You can always change it. The Zetamix began with chaos, but as time and hard work went on, order and comfort set place. So the moral of the story is, make sure you touch grass once in a while and subscribe.